all rested and saved, ready to take on the main cannon here. And it is boss time. We're up against the soul gun and its launchers. Uh, what we need to do here is do a little different than what I've done before. Uh, we need to throw a lightning skill. I've got three of them. Why not? Why not just throw it at that one right there? And it hits them all. Okay, good. Like I was about to say, I thought it hit them all. Uh, he's got launchers. Hmm. I'm not sure if that did what I think it did, but we still need to hit all three things here. I believe that that missile always does half your HP. We need to go for Rama as well. Go Rama. For damn a lot of damage. And down go both of the launchers, which is what we really wanted to take out. Now the soul gun, it should pretty much spend the rest of the time here charging up its laser. But I should be fine from here on out, to be honest with you. Safety lock off. Oh no. Now those missiles, they can cast old on you. There's no other way to phrase that. I don't... It, it always sounds wrong when I do try to say it. They cast old. They can do that. I can't tell if they hit it with Bart's because I can't see Bart's hair. Uh, the only real indication of that is that your hair turns gray. Barrel pressure rising. Yeah? Well, so is this. Damn. That does a lot of damage. Like 800 there? Oh, come on. Do the lightning attack as well. Go bolt too. And then I think I can go for a Rama as well after this. And I should be fine with that. Go Judgment Bolt. Now, I don't think that the summons... Yeah, you know, the summons damage don't get split like the regular magic attack does. Uh, so, if there's just one enemy as opposed to multiple, uh, the summon's not going to suddenly do more damage that way. Just keep on fighting it. I don't. I haven't had any luck with stealing, so I'm just going to go with that. And it's still charging its laser. It has a ton of HP, to be honest with you. I'm not too concerned. Uh, yeah, let's just go for another summon. Uh, I'm not too concerned about this laser. You know, he spends all day charging it up. It reminds me of some other fights from some other games where they spend the entire fight charging it up, but. When it does get the chance to fire, it doesn't do that much damage, as opposed to the other fights where if you let it hit you, you're screwed. Oh, but it does have a drain on it, which is no good. So let's go ahead and cure that when we get a chance. Well, we need to cure it anyway. 800 more, still not enough for the victory, though. This guy can take forever. Uh, yes, Bart's did get olded. That that did show up, which is why uh, he's not doing as much damage as I would like. I don't believe there is a cure for old, but yeah, he's not doing that much damage anymore. Sensor cannon activated. Oh no, whatever shall I do? Unfortunately, it looks like uh, my Rama attack is going to be gone now. I forgot that this drains you, your HP. I thought I was going to be able to use him for... Uh, Rama damn near the entire time. He is, Bart's is aging. He's not old. He's aging. Because he's not that old yet. I guess. Blair brush arising again. Once again, not that concerning. Not that concerning at all. How much damage are you doing? 64. And then 192. That is not very good. You're not even doing 300 damage. 800 more. And down goes the soul gun, which was interesting. It didn't fade like a normal boss. It exploded. Yes, you get 100 gil, 10 experience, and 7 ability points. Bart's has gained a job level because of that, and he's learned fire static, is I believe how I'm supposed to say that. We'll take a look at that in a second. And it looks like I've gotten an item as well because the music has not stopped. What item did I get? I got one Dark Matter and two potions. I will take it. Now, the cavity has opened up for us to enter in. Can we make it through that opening? It's worth a try. Do it. 
or I could back off and heal. So I'm going to back off and heal because why not? And I'll be right back. All healed and saved and ready to go into the cavity. But first, I want to go over my setup a little bit here. I have changed Bart's back to a sorcerer, ran it back to a thief. I was wrong in how I'm supposed to pronounce uh, that ability that we just learned as a ninja. I never used this before and I don't know why. This is not fire static, I think is how I was saying it. It's first attack. The way that they abbreviate things, sometimes I just cannot read it. So it raises the percentage of you getting the first strike, which is always nice. So that's why I'm going to have it on Bart. And I feel that's better than any of the other abilities that we have going here. Magiwall would probably be the best after that, but I am happy with that setup. Reyna is back on a thief, uh, pretty much because I want a thief in my party. Because there are a lot of secret passages throughout this next dungeon. So I have given her counter, which I believe is probably the best thing for her at this time. I might go with bare fist though. Bare fist might be good, but I'm going to stick with counter for now. And uh, Gallif and Ferris are, are on their way moving forward. Uh, I've changed Bart's, of course, because he's leveled up. And I would like to get more uh, sorcerer abilities moving forward. Let's head on inside here. And we have made it into... Holy crap, do we run fast when we have a thief? And as we have made it to the ruins of Ronka. Uh, now that I have a thief in my party, I no longer have to worry about uh, finding secret passages. They'll just appear to me, like these right here. Just the second room. And there are already secret passages. Are there new enemies here? There are. And we got a first strike, which is damn awesome. Uh, I don't believe uh, these guys have anything I want to steal in particular. Uh, we're going to go with a bolt two on him. I was trying to figure out for a second there why uh, he didn't have max MP, but that's because I changed jog classes after I missed at the end, which is a stupid thing. Don't do that. Not very smart of me. Go Rama. Now that we got the first strike, I might as well use a summon. Everything here is pretty much weak to lightning. So down go the stoned whatever they were. Now we're just on the Ronka Knight. So I do have uh, the Moon Ring on Reyna and the Coral Sword on Bart, which should be pretty damn sweet for him. Especially if he would hit... But he refuses to because he sucks. Okay, we're going to go for Bolt 2. I believe everything here is weak to lightning. These guys might not be. These guys might not be, but uh, it's pretty safe to say that most things around here are. Uh, you yeah, know, we'll go for a Cure 2. I don't think anybody really got hurt, but why not? Why not? In fact, only Raina got hit. Should have just smacked her upside the face. That probably would have been better for her. Damn it, stop missing with the moon ring. There we go. Now, could you hit somebody? Yeah, they, they aren't that weak to lightning. Not nearly as much as I thought. Not nearly as much as I thought. We're going to save some, some MP then. And just flat out attack. Just hit him. Wait, don't... Why did I hit with Gallop? That was a stupid idea. Who came up with that idea? Why did I heal the damn Ronka Knight? <laughs> Why? Why am I stupid sometimes? I'm just learning... Uh, gotta learn how to spam properly, and apparently I just don't do that right at all. Um, yeah, go for... Uh, we'll see. How does fire do? How does fire do against this guy? I think that did better than the lightning, to be honest with you, but it was just one guy, so it's hard to tell. You get 810 gil, 350 experience, and one ability point. Anybody level up? We haven't gotten experience in a long-ass time. Still no level ups. We're still on level 18. We've been that for quite some time now. Uh, but now I need to head down here and grab myself the gold armor, which I do believe is going to be an upgrade for Bart's here. It is. From the ninja suit. Uh, up by three on uh, defense, down by one on speed, but that's okay. You're still on the ninja suit, right? Yeah. Okay. We're good. We are good. Now, we can head down to the third level. And we have found another secret passage. Did we also find new enemies? 
We did! We found a fan wizard! Let's go ahead and fight him. Damn, this guy is pretty damn weak. I don't, I don't think I need to do much casting at all against- Oh! Fuck, I did it again! Why? Why do I forget that I have the healing rod on Gallo? Yes, you can carry your enemies. I think I've proven that by now. So there went my first strike. It's just been negated because Gallo doesn't know when what I mean. And there's Arrow 2 who doesn't do very much at all. Let's just continue to fight. I should be able to finish this guy. Uh, I don't know if you guys can tell. Um, that is actually a face and a torso on the far left. Uh, you can see the face. I think the face is pretty clear here. But if you look carefully above the two eyes, you'll notice that there is another face up there. It's a very interesting looking enemy, I must say, the fan wizard. Down it goes, though. Down it goes. Yes, you get 207 gil, 117 experience, and one ability point for that. I will take anything that I can get, to be honest with you. So, we need to head over here, and I believe I want to take the second one here. Yes, I do. And we can get an elixir out of there. Do we have any more new enemies, though? I don't think we do, actually, no. Nope, more of these guys. Alright, let's head forward here. We... huh. You know, this reminds me of the dungeon design in Final Fantasy III, the end dungeon. I think you guys know what I'm talking about. Uh, let's just continue on. I think there are a couple more enemies I need to find here. There are. This is a Lamia. We have definitely seen this in previous games. I remember this specifically. Now, if I remember right, there was one of the sprites for the Lamia that actually had to be changed for American audiences. I think either there was a cleavage or, like, butt cleavage. I don't know how, to, how else to phrase that. And they had to change it. I should have just smacked Bart's upside the face. That would have healed him better. But I think we should be doing fine with the Lamy. Uh, no, still not dead. I still probably need a couple more attacks here. And then I can smack... Oh, I don't need to smack Bart's because we won. Yes, you get 210 gil, 122 experience, and one ability point, which isn't very much, but I'll take anything that I can get. Like I said, I think there was either cleavage or something like that in one of the Lamia sprites that needed to be taken out for American audiences on the Super Nintendo. Let's get that phoenix down out of that chest and head down further. This place is quite a complicated set of ruins with machine parts everywhere. I, I don't fully understand. Do we have any more new enemies? I believe there is still one more we need to see. Nope, fan wizards. Let's move on. We need to head over here and grab ourselves a gold shield, which I probably should have equipped before I got into this battle with fan wizard. We got that shield equipped. Now, there is an ability that the fan wizards do have called White Wind that will heal themselves. I would like to get that as blue magic eventually, but I'm having a real hard time getting them to cast it on me right now. So even though they have it, I can't really get to it just yet, though. We will come up with a solution to that later. All in due time. Let's head up here, though, where we do find ourselves a save point, which I will be using. And we will continue going through this dungeon next time. That is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Final Fantasy V. I've been joined, as always, by my cresting squad of Bart's Reina, Gallif, and Ferris. Like I said, when we come back, further into the dungeon. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.